Sometimes, nature just gets the best of you. Part of landscape photography is dealing with whatever conditions are thrown your way. And on this trip, wind was the order of the day. Day 3 of my Death Valley 2018 trip was a short one. After a restful night sleeping in my truck sheltered from fierce winds that raged all night long, I awoke to clear skies and another windy day. I decided to try and squeeze in some more images in the badlands of 20 Mule Team Canyon before packing up and heading home. Conditions were less than ideal, but I wanted to make the best of them. Further, my video camera batteries had died, and so all I had to work with was my iPhone. I managed the best I could. Here's what I got. Due to the lack of an external microphone for my iPhone, the sound quality for this first clip was unusable. In summary, I was explaining that I was shooting in my pajamas and slippers because I'd woken up late and it was freezing cold. I got out the 4x5 first because it was windy and later managed a couple of successful exposures on the 8x10. Well, I'm still here in my pajamas and slippers and uh decided to load up some 8x10 Delta 100 on the uh, big camera and shoot this uh, Badland behind me. And I think it'll work. Um, figured, you know, I'm not out here all that often, so it was worth the trouble of uh, loading up some 8x10 and, uh, you know, getting that uh, loaded up. So now I'm going to head home, I think, for real. Um, Got to eat some breakfast first, and make some coffee, and then uh, get on the road after some prep. So, it's been a good trip. This is day three of Death Valley 2018. Well, I just stopped in Stovepipe Wells to uh, grab some, to make some breakfast and grab some fuel and water. And um, I'm about to head up over uh, the pass and uh, head out of Death Valley. So. It's been a very productive trip, I think. I made four exposures this morning, four last night, five yesterday afternoon, and seven uh, the previous evening and morning. So anyways, pretty good shot, pretty good trip. <laughs> anyway, yeah, so uh, time to head home. My Death Valley 2018 trip was an exercise in dealing with whatever conditions nature threw my way. Death Valley is a wild and unpredictable place, and I wouldn't have it any other way. It's precisely this wild, untamed nature that makes wilderness so appealing, and Death Valley is the perfect place to experience it. The desert is hard on people and equipment alike, and the challenge of facing whatever the desert throws at me is part of what keeps me coming back. Limitation is the mother of creativity, and a major part of why I choose to shoot large format film. On this trip, blue skies and extreme winds created creative limitations that forced me to improvise. I spent time in secluded canyons and badlands areas in an effort to avoid the wind and simply dealt with it wherever I could. As a result, the images I came away with were very different from those that I would have created were conditions more ideal for landscape photography. I'm grateful to have had this opportunity to test myself and my gear and some challenging conditions, and I'm confident I'll be better off for it. I hope to return again to Death Valley, hopefully to more ideal conditions, and this time with that shipment of Color Velvia, which finally arrived well after I returned from the trip. I hope you've enjoyed following along on this journey with me. I must apologize that the production value on these first few videos is pretty rough due to a lack of budget for video and audio equipment and also due to being a bit rusty with the tools as well. I'll be aggressively improving production value and quality in future videos. I hope you'll like, subscribe, and come along for the adventure. Thanks for watching and until next time, stay curious.